Everything Top 10 is proud to present the Top 10 Things You Didn't Know About Dalvin Cook. Number 10. He attended the same high school as Devontae Freeman, born Dalvin James Cook in West Florida. Cook attended the Miami Central High School, the same school that current Atlanta Falcons star running back Devontae Freeman attended. In fact, Cook apparently revered Freeman so much that he initially chose not to enter the football program until his sophomore year. He figured that he was not as skilled and would have no chance of usurping the then senior running back Freeman. Freeman had led the Miami Central class of 2010 to a Class 6A state title. Cook himself later led his class in 2013 to a Class 6A regional title, beating rivals Palm Bay Heritage in the process. Number 9. Cook was a star sprinter in high school. As a running back, it is not surprising that he was also an athletic star in his formative years. He ran track in high school and was, in fact, one of the top sprinters in the state. For instance, in the 200-meter dash in 2013, he recorded a personal best of about 22.10 seconds at the Sam Burley Invitational. He was also part of the Miami Central winning relay team, running both the 4x100-meter and 4x400-meter relays and helping his team win in both events. He also excelled in the 100-meter dash, coming in fifth place in the finals. Number 8. He was named Florida's Mr. Football in 2013. He joined an elite group of athletes in Florida when he was named Mr. Football in 2013 by the Florida Dairy Farmers Association. He became only the third recipient of the award from the Miami-Dade County. The others were Ja'Cory Harris, who won the title in 2007, and Duke Johnson in 2011. The award is typically given to the top high school football player in the state, with many past winners going on to have illustrious careers in the NFL. Number 7. Cook changed his college allegiance several times. He reportedly changed his allegiance several times when it came to choosing the right college to play for. According to reports, he initially had committed to Clemson University before later flipping to the University of Florida to play for then-coach Will Muschamp. Florida did not perform well that season, and after the 4-8 and eight season, Cook is said to have started wavering on his pledge, at least privately. He again switched his commitment from Florida to Florida State, pledging his future to the Seminoles in 2014. Number 6. He has had a lot of off-the-field troubles. In 2015, he was charged with battery after a woman alleged that he had punched her in the face. Even though a jury found him not guilty, this was only one in a seemingly long line of troubles with the state. As a juvenile in high school, he was once arrested and charged with robbery. He was also arrested for the possession and firing of a weapon at an event on school property. He also received a citation for mistreating three puppies that he had tied together and also picked up a criminal mischief charge for a BB gun fight in 2014. He has been clean for the past few years though and has seemingly turned a corner in terms of maturity. Number 5. Cook broke Florida State University's all-time rushing yards record in a single season. As a sophomore, he broke Warwick Dunn's mark of 1,242 rushing yards in a single season in a game against NC State, running for 11 yards on his third carry of the game for a total of 1,246 yards on the season. Dunn's record had been set in 1995. Number 4. He comes from an athletic family. He is not the only outstanding athlete in his immediate family. He comes from a family of eight, including dad James Cook and mom Verandria Burnett. His elder brother DeAndre is an outstanding basketball player, a shooting guard who plays for the University of Mississippi. He should be eligible to take part in the 2020 NBA draft. His younger brother James is also a skilled running back who, after being courted by several top colleges, eventually settled on the University of Georgia. Number 3. Cook is dating high school sweetheart Jacqueline Morris. Around the time of the NFL draft in 2017, he and Morris were reportedly expecting their first child, a son he chose to name Dalvin Cook Jr. Cook has been with Morris for a long time, with the two being friends since childhood. The couple, however, keeps their private life a secret, and not much has been revealed about their relationship. Number 2. He has struggled with injuries throughout his career. His ride has not always been smooth sailing when it comes to injuries. In college, for instance, he lost three quarters of his rookie season to a left ACL tear. He has had to undergo surgeries after injuring his knee and has also suffered from hamstring injuries. Number 1. Cook was raised by his grandmother. He lived with his grandmother for a large portion of his younger years, moving permanently to his grandmother's house in 2007. His grandmother, Betty Cook, known to the neighborhood and to football coaches as Miss Betty, always welcomed troubled kids into her house. Miss Betty took in future football stars and Miami Central players, including Tavius Brown and Devontae Phillips, two of Cook's teammates. Miss Betty would often donate clothes to students who needed them, going as far as tailoring them if they did not fit. That's all, folks. 
please leave a like if you enjoyed the video and comment down below which NFL player you want to see us make a video about next. Make sure you subscribe to us as well. Also, tell us if you think Dalvin Cook is better than Christian McCaffrey. See you next time.